Hello everyone! Welcome to my 365 day painting challenge. This is Susan McManaman and we're on week 10, painting 64 through 70. Okay, we're starting off with the best painting of the week and one of my all-time favorite subjects, the poinsettia. And then we're moving on to glass Christmas ornaments, the round variety. We painted a lot of those this week and one silver coffee pot. Yeah, this was a demo for a student, a returning new student. And then this is a new subject, Christmas lights inside a glass face. That was fun to try. I'd like to paint a larger version of that. Now this is a demo. This is the only time lapse for this week. And I shot a lot more video than what you see here. What my plan is to take this and make a more of a step-by-step demonstration of how to paint this yourself. So hopefully I will get that finished in the next few days and so keep an eye out. I hope to have it posted by this weekend at the latest. One thing to remember and when you're doing this type of subject is keep an eye on what your background is. And I'm not talking the background in the subject itself but the background that's reflecting in your glass ornaments. It makes it a lot easier if you don't have a very busy background behind you that's reflecting in your glass ornament. And the next thing you're going to do, I mean I had a super tough time making sure that my ornaments were perfectly round. And because your paint is wet it's not like you can put a template on top of it. So uh, one of the tricks that you'll see here shortly is to turn it on its side and then turn it upside down and you'll be able to see if things are round or not. Especially when it's turned upside down you'll notice if things aren't looking quite right. So I was checking the measurements to see if I had them equally um, from side to side. Yeah, we got, we got kind of close. And why not take it to the next level, right? This is Peggy's idea. Thank you, Peggy, for stacking those ornaments in a ball jar. That's it for me for this week. Thanks so much for watching. Have a wonderful holiday, and we'll see you next week.